Okay, signals and slots. We start off by going to the Qt Creator. Click on File, New File or Project, Qt Widget Project, then Qt GUI Application. Click on Choose. Give it a name. I called mine Test03. Next. 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 Finish. I come to the main window dot cpp. Hmm. It's not what I want. I go to the main window dot ui. I double click. And you come here. Go over to the left side window where all our tools are displayed. Go to that little text box and filter out everything but the progress bar by keying in the word P-R-O-G and bingo, it's already done. You'll see progress bar. Drag the progress bar onto the form. And voila, there it is. Go back over to that text box. Filter out everything but the horizontal slider. Key in H, O, and oops, it's already done. There it is. Then what do we do? We drag the horizontal slider to the form, like so. And there it is. Voila. This horizontal bar is ugly. I want to get rid of it. Right click. Remove Tool Main Toolbar. It's gone, and I'm happy. Now click here where it says Edit Signals Slash Slots. I will have to click on this object, the slider, and drag to this object, the progress bar. Okay, let's do it. So now I click on this object, and it turns red. I drag to object number two, and it turns red too. I release my mouse, and voila, this window appears. Here is the signal we're looking for. I click on value changed int one time. I go to the right side. This will be its slot. Set value int. I click on this guy one time. Then I click on OK. Oh, wow, look at that. Amazing. I didn't do that. The system did. These two rascals are now linked together. I now run the program. I click on Mr. Green Arrow. Oops, save all. And voila, there is my program. That is amazing. It says 24% by default all the time. Don't worry about it. That will change as soon as you start to move the slider around. So let's start moving the slider around. I just made it a little bit bigger to see better. And I'll move the slider now. There we go. It's that way till you move the slider, and now it's at 2%. Let me move it a little bit more, and... Oh, it's at 38%. The progress bar follows the slider's movements as I drag it. Let me drag it all the way, almost, over to the right. And, wow, that's it. It's at 99%, and we're done. For now. This program worked. And this is Hoboken here. Bye-bye.